On this edition of the Mets Prospect Profiles, we're going to talk about another young starting pitcher who the Mets are hoping will make an impact in the major leagues in a couple of years. But he is a very well thought of prospect. Let's talk about him right now. And well, 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 welcome back to New York Sports Wicker Media. I'm Watts UK99. Thank you, as always, for taking the time to watch these videos. If you are new here, welcome aboard. Please like and subscribe. If you're returning, welcome back. I appreciate everybody's support. So on this edition of MPP, as I guess we could call it, we're going to talk about the number nine ranked prospect in the New York Mets organization. It's right-handed pitcher Calvin Ziegler. So let's talk a little bit about Mr. Ziegler. Born October 30th, 2002, 20 years old. He is from Kitchener, Ontario, Canada. Kitchener, home of the Kitchener Rangers hockey team. No, not affiliated with the New York Rangers, by the way. He's six feet tall, 205 pounds. He's expected to be a starting pitcher. Uh, we're going to talk about his starting versus relieving um, acumen as we go on. So, talking about the history of Calvin Ziegler, he was eligible to be drafted in 2020. However... That's right. There was a pandemic, and there was no minor league season anyway. He was drafted in the second round in 2021, 46 overall by the New York Mets, and he signed for a below slot bonus of $900,000. Now, he did pitch in St. Lucie a little bit. Now, looking at his stats, it's a very mixed bag. In 16 games, he pitched 46 innings, went 0-6, not too good, and in those 46 innings, allowed 26 hits, 23 earned runs, walk 35, and through nine wild pitches. That's pretty alarming. That shows uh, some tendencies of control problems. He did strike out 70, which is really good. That equates to 13 and a half strikeouts per nine innings pitched. All right, so that's a pretty good ratio. His whip, walks plus hits divided by innings pitched, was 1.3. And the ZRA was 4.44. Not great. Pr pretty uh, pretty subpar. This is a kid who's still really learning how to pitch in professional baseball and harness his talent. So what talent does he have? Well, he's got good arm strength. He uh, typically sits around 93 miles per hour. He's touched as high as 97. Now that fastball tends to work down in the zone because it has natural sink on it. So Ziegler ideally is getting ground balls when his fastball is working well, okay? Now he's got a curveball, throws in the low 80s. It's shown some good bite. Uh, even uh, last year in San Lucie, that curveball was his second uh, most used pitch. And of his three pitches, the curveball is the one that's getting the highest swing and miss percentage, okay? So batters are swinging and missing on that curveball. Now, as is typical of high schoolers who are entering the pros, Ziggler is also focusing on a changeup as well to try to keep uh, batters off balance as well. So it's really the development of that third pitch that he's going to need if he's going to be a legitimate starting pitcher. Without it, he may only be a reliever. So under the Mets' watch going forward, the big thing to watch for is Calvin Ziggler's command. Can he control his off-speed pitches in particular? You know, he was inconsistent in the spring of 22, and if that keeps up, you know, he's, he's ticketed for the bullpen, but that decision is probably still a few years away. Now, the tuning of his mechanics will come later, but he does show raw ability and the, and the uh, opportunity he can get swings and misses with his pitches. So this is a very raw prospect at this point. He's going to start the year in St. Lucie. I think he's probably going to be there for the year. And over the next, I'd say, two years, I think at that point we'll have a better feel if this is a starter or if it's a reliever. I think as far as reaching Major League Baseball, it's going to be a few years away. It may take till 2025. I see high upside with him, some good upside, but there definitely is bust potential. So this is one that we're going to have to watch out for. Uh, if you have any thoughts on Calvin Ziggler, put them right down there in the comments. I'd love to hear what you think. I'll be back here uh, on the weekend with my next uh, MPP. I think I'm going to do a, a position player. I got somebody in mind that I think we should talk about. Well, thanks, everybody, for watching. I'll see you back here with more content from you know where, the Wicker Chair.